Yes, bikinis, no. Barista centerfolds, hot topic in Seattle. Denise Whitaker with affiliate KOMO has the story. Visiting Seattle Center and the Space Needle, it's all about taking pictures. But now that souvenir photo could include a sexy image that would be better on the back page of your scrapbook. Yes, these baristas right across the street from Seattle's signature tourist attraction wear nothing more than bikinis. That attracts more customers. Sex sells. Skimpy outfits, equal fat tips. I used to work mornings at another coffee stand, make $30 in the morning. Here I make four or five times that much, if not more. Because you're wearing a bikini? Because I'm wearing a bikini and people pay more for that. It's kind of be yourself. It's the city. Everybody's different and so I think it's okay. But do unsuspecting tourists feel the same? I thought it was kind of strange. Do you think this is giving a good, you know, first impression for tourists to our area? Probably not. And then just add 50 cents. They're behind the booths and stuff, so it's, it's not as bad as it could be. But this isn't the beach. Seattle Center draws kids with its family fun force, children's museum, and more. Well, the bikinis don't belong there. They belong in the beach. The coffee, yes. Seattle is known for its coffee, yeah, really could it also coffee. become known for its baristas? Whoa. In this case, yes, as these baristas ended up the centerfolds for these tourists from India. Thank you. In Seattle, Denise Whitaker, Como 4 News.